I decided to order this in a medium. So I got this and this is how it looks. It's very durable, like it's harder. It's given, okay? Compared to my Yahira, other than this part being like stiff, the rest of it just looks like a little, <laughs> like I don't know what this is. <laughs> Hey family, hope you guys are doing well. If you're new to my channel, you're most welcome. Thank you so much for joining us today. I have been away for over six months. I know I'm super, super sorry for that. But hopefully this is going to be the first, you know, video to get me to post more frequently, you know. But yeah, um, we're going to be doing a review today on this shapewear. If you know me, you know I'm in my 30s and it's that time to start, you know, tucking nipping and tucking right so I found the shapewear from this website on Instagram so it's called Chic Curve and it's this Puerto Rican girl advertised in it I'm gonna post a picture of the girl and I tried on the shapewear so I ordered first I ordered this on the 20th of August and it came in on the 2nd of September so about two weeks um, They did have a they do have, still have the 12% discount code But when I ordered it, I didn't I didn't see it, you know, I only saw the discount code after the fact anyways, but Long story short, I got the shapewear and I really like the shapewear I actually think this is my favorite shapewear just yet. The only issue I have is that the zipper is gonna protrude a little bit you know so let me show you guys what the shape what looks like and then I'm gonna put it on okay so this is what the shape what looks like it has it's what it looks like the best part and this is what the back looks like it's mesh so which is good you don't have like the fake booty or nothing big booty cheeks you don't have that it's just a regular see-through material um you may see a little bit of the stitching, like this part of it, but, and the zipper part, but that's the only issue I have with the shapewear. Precisely the zipper part, because once you zip it up like this, this part is more likely to protrude just a little bit, you know? So you just have to pick the right outfits to wear with the shapewear. Uh, another thing I don't really like is the, you know, what is it called? kind of like the, the arms I don't really like the arms because I feel like the I don't know where they're supposed to go they're supposed to be on the side but for some reason I feel like it's coming too close to like the boobs like right here so it's kind of hard it's hard to hide those so I take them off okay I have worn this out before so this is better than my Yahira for sure not only is it cheaper without the coupon I think I paid like $45 let me make sure so yeah here's how much I paid for it for the four dollars and I uh, and I ordered this it's six dollars shipping so it's forty four dollars thirty six dollars plus six dollars in shipping everything comes up to about forty four dollars and honestly for the price it's easy to put on that's like the best part for me Compared to my Yahira, just wearing it, you have to make sure your nails, like you have to be, it's really, Yahira is a little bit difficult. And because it's quite stretchy, it, it was really difficult. For, it's always difficult for me to put it on. Like sometimes you want to put on the shapewear, but you're like, I don't want to have to go through the process of, you know, pulling and it's just a lot. But this, the best part about this shapewear, oh my goodness, you guys, is the bottom. It has a zipper. Like that's, this whole part is the bottom part. So I tried to use it to pee. And when I tell you it was easy, it was definitely easy. And I'm gonna compare that proportion with this Yahira. This is all you get for the Yahira for, to pee. This is it, that's it. That's all you're gonna get to pee. So this is what it looks like to pee compared to like this like no matter how big you are 
you can still find a way to like a wheel you know what I'm saying handle your business like that anyways another thing I'm gonna talk about with the shapewear is the proportion the legs with the Yahira I told you guys when I did the initial review that I, by that time I hadn't worn it out so I couldn't attest to you know the the motility of the garment when you know when you're out and about but with this one and so when I started wearing the Yahira out I realized that the legs were definitely rolling look look how curly it is so the legs would actually roll and I was super irritated you know and another thing is that when I compare and this is the shorts when I compare that to this one I can actually put this one like a little bit under my butt and you can't see it so it's a little bit better compared to my Yahira it was just like it shows more and then this one when I'm moving it doesn't move that was the best part about this it also has the same stickiness on the legs like the Yahira but for some reason the Yahira does roll this doesn't and I also like the, the lacy part of it just because it looks I think it looks better like look at the Yahira it just looks like legs that has been cut it looks like someone just cut the legs it in and then do any stitching you know but this the work seems very seamless and I love it okay what else is there to talk about okay sizing sizing is like a huge part of this because if you get the wrong size girl you ain't gonna be able to fit in that's all I'm gonna say you're not gonna be able to fit into it so this one so since I graduated school from pharmacy school I'm gonna post a video you guys since I graduated I left from a size 6 to a size 8 like in no time when I mean a 6 to an 8 like this that's how it's happened so now your girl's chubby, my cheeks are rounded, and everything. So when I ordered this, usually I'm like a size small, you know what I'm saying? But with this, after I ordered some outfits from Old Polly, it with a, like in a size six, they came in and I couldn't fit in. I knew better, so I ordered this in a size medium. When I tell you, girl, I still have to like tuck, which is good. Because had I ordered a small, there would have been no way to get into it. So with a medium, I can easily, not easily, I can get into the medium without any help from anybody, which the ship where you don't need anyone to help you because when you need to go, you need to just go, you know. So it's easy to put in, to put on, and it does stay still. So I wore it without the handles because I told you guys I didn't like where the hand. The hands were placing so I could I don't know maybe I did it wrong I'll do it again this time and show you guys but when I did it I didn't like how it was just hanging like across my boots so I ended up just taking it off and it stayed still it didn't roll like because that would just irritate the heck out of me you know what I mean but it didn't do that um, what else can I tell you guys about the sheep where again let me lift it up so you can see what it looks like before I go ahead and try it on okay that's what it looks like the material is very very durable that's what I'm gonna say like it's very very durable it does have um, it does have the corset of uh, hooks to hook them and then when you when you're done hooking them up then you're just gonna zip so as a size 8 that I am now Getting a size medium was actually the best choice because again, it's a little bit tight to get into, which is good. You want your shape to be difficult to get into, so in that way it's gonna suck you up. You don't wanna just put it on like a regular outfit because if you do, you're not gonna like what it's gonna do because then it defeats the purpose of cinching you in, you know? So, with that said, um, since I ordered a, a size medium, I'm very happy with, with my, um, the size but I'm kind of worried for everybody else out there that is like bigger you know what I mean because it made the size me get tricky so if you're probably like a 10 I don't know if it's a medium is gonna fit because when I tell you guys y'all are gonna see me put it on usually I don't like to wear it stuff on camera you know what I'm saying cuz I just find it very weird to you know to 
to watch it so I never like to like to it on camera but I'm gonna show you guys how I get into it so you see what I'm talking about you know and you tell me what you guys think but if you're bigger than me like a size size um size 10 I don't know I have a big stomach too so maybe that's why it's kind of hard to fit into a medium but yeah let's go try it on and see how it looks here you're gonna see me put it on the shapewear as you can see I'm clearly um, struggling to fit all my <laughs> pouches in there but what I can say is I have a fupa the lower part of my stomach is just hard to like wear clothing without feeling insecure about it so this shapewear helps to like tuck everything this is the perfect shapewear you guys it's the best $40 I've ever spent on anything like a shapewear um, I'm not a fan of the straps so if you um if you're not capable of holding your stomach in like me I can't hold my stomach in because my stomach is detached if you have um, a baby belly this is the perfect shapewear to wear I'm not a fan of the straps and the zipper part at the end it does zip the clothing I wore it underneath a pair of pants and I had no issues with that I couldn't see the the shapewear so that was amazing actually so I'll definitely be doing that more under like a jumpsuit yeah so as you can see in the middle of the dress you can see this huge imprint that's what I'm talking about the shapewear is very very prominent especially at the top that's the main issue I have and also I'm wearing the straps so you can see the the back it has the imprint of the straps which I don't like so I prefer to wear without the straps I love the shapewear in all I would say definitely get it make sure your sizing is actually right check their website for this for the sizing but overall go ahead and get the shapewear like this video if you like it comment share it with your friends all right guys i'll see you in my next one until then take care bye